Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Daggerfall. So in the last episode, the Queen of Daggerfall sent us to Shidungan to go check on her husband's grandmother, who she feared was going out of her mind, and she wanted us to report back to her on her condition. After having to deal with a bunch of battle mages, we were able to find Nilfaga, who was indeed a little bit out of her mind, and we reported back to the Queen to receive our bell. Not the most exciting reward, but okay, it is enchanted. Don't know what it does yet. Maybe we'll get to try it out today. But I'm kind of thinking today we're going to need to do more Fighters Guild quests just because we actually are waiting on a letter that we're supposed to receive sometime after we've hit level three, which we have. And also real quick, I am going to turn off full screen just because I like the little icons. I think they're cute. I like looking at Sorik's dumb face. And the only feedback I received on the subject was in favor of the little icons, so- and also they're useful! Like, I don't know all the hotkeys for everything yet, so... It's good for me to be able to click on them sometime. Now, we did ask where the Fighters Guild was, I can't remember exactly- ah. It was over here, so hopefully we can still get inside so we can sleep. Because it's very dark! And then in the morning we can ask for a mission and hopefully receive a letter sometime along the way. I hope nothing can like attack me. I'm kind of afraid I'm gonna get mugged <laughs> and it's gonna freak me out. But we're, we're almost there and it's not that late. Like it was sunset as we walked into the castle so hopefully we're fine and hopefully we can still get in here if I can find the door. Here we go. We were able to get inside. It looks like it's laid out the exact same as the other ones, same people and everything. Yeah, it's literally spot on. So that means the beds should be right here. Let's just rest for a good eight hours, I guess. Hopefully that'll be enough. There we go. I wonder what the trainer could do for us. It costs 300, do you wish to receive training? But I don't know what it's for! Ooh, I should buy either a cart or a horse this episode. I think... I think I should have enough money. I still need to sell some stuff. Like, I've got a lot of miscellaneous stuff. I don't know where to sell all that. I did get rid of my ingredients, which is good. But how am I doing on encumbrance? Oh, you know, it's not so bad. But we have almost 6,000 gold, so hopefully we can buy something with that. But let's go ahead and get a quest. Okay, once again, it's the werewolf one. I'm gonna say no. I don't think I have to reload. You guys told me I didn't. I just want to see if we can get anything new. But I feel like this is about just kind of what we have. This one's paying even more than the werewolf one. It's paying 184 gold. Just for a wild animal that has gotten into someone's house. Which, we all know how that went last time. But, um, sure, we'll take it. Why not? I don't think we can be too picky anymore because it seems like we've done the basics of everything. If you guys want me to join like another guild or faction or something, let me know. Because I still kind of want to join the Akatosh Chantry or whatever it was called. Anyways. Okay, Sorik. Get over to Theoden's General Smithy. Alright, hopefully they'll at least be open. Maybe I can sell them some stuff too. Here in town. Get it done in one day. Nobody wants an animal left roaming around in their place. Come back here when the beast is dead and I'll have your pay waiting for you. Alabaster Wickhouse calls out, Hey, what kind of animal is it in Theoden's General Smithy? You hear a voice call out from an upper floor, It's a tiger! I want to kill a tiger? I don't want to kill a tiger, come on. They're endangered! Though, I assume not here. But I'm actually quite interested to see what a tiger looks like. Now let's ask this guy where it would be. Would that be an armor? Yeah. It's just keep going south. Why do y'all talk like this? Can you put it on my map, please? To keep going south. I know, but to mark it on my map, please. Hey, maybe I already have it on my map. I don't know. I like that one. Go north. No, east. No, just keep going south. <laughs> okay, well, he, he's not gonna mark it on my map. Maybe it's already on there. We're not gonna be able to check in here. It's still nighttime. Oh, what is that? No, no, no. What? 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 What happened? That was terrifying! I died, apparently. It also said the ghost died? Or the wraith? What? Uh, okay, I'm glad I just 
saved. I guess we'll be sleeping some more. That was so terrifying. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go back to bed. I don't want to deal with that. That means we're wasting precious time that we could be slaying a tiger with, but let's just sleep for a few more hours. Hopefully that's enough. You know what? A couple more, just in case. Terrifying. Okay, let's go outside and hopefully not get mugged by a wraith. What did I say? I said it would happen. Oh my god. Okay, do we already have it on our map or something? Uh, I'm not really seeing anything, so maybe we should ask someone else and they'll put it on our map. What about you? Okay, she put it on her map. She says it's awfully close by too. Good. But is it true? Oh yeah, it's just right down there. Okay. I'm still shaken. Like, what was that? I mean, it was a wraith, but like, why? Why was there a wraith? I can't believe the Fighters Guild locked me out too. What the heck? Okay, it looks like this is it. It's locked again. Okay, but it, it might just not be open yet. Let's see. 9 to 19. Okay. Well, I guess maybe we'll just loiter for a little bit. It's illegal to camp. Oh. Did I just violate the law? Are you kidding me? Come on, I didn't even wait. There's so many of them! Just for standing here! Are you... Just kill me. Just kill me. No! No, I don't want to. I'm reloading. This is stupid. Just because I pressed the wrong button, I am peeved. Okay. Let's try that again. By loitering. Two hours? I don't know what time it is. I forgot how to check. Someday I'll actually figure out how to play this game. But it's open now. We're fine. Oh my god! Instantly greet it! Look at him! Oh, he's so cool! Oh. Oh, well that lasted long. You were just hammering away while that was going on? It's no treasure. Okay, well, I guess while we're here, I'll just sell some stuff. I'll give the price I only offer to my closest friends and family. I doubt that. The market value of that is much less. I mean, it says cost 248 right up there. Are you sure? But I think I can give you 65 gold. Sure. That's fine. Do you take any other things? No. I don't know where I sell all the misc stuff. Not really sure about that, but let's see what he has, you know? Leather, arrow, a bunch of crap, really. I want something like dwarven or better so that I can actually kill the harpies with the sword. But there's different things. I want a flail, but I need a good flail. Didn't know flails were a thing, and I love flails. At least I didn't know they were a thing in Daggerfall. Obviously, I already know what they were. Yeah, I, I think what we have is better than all of this. Except for, do we even have gauntlets? I don't think we have gauntlets. How much is that gonna cost though? Ooh, cost, cost a good amount. I don't, I don't know about all that. I kinda want a cart instead. Maybe I should run to a general store real quick. Well, I guess I should go back to the Fighters Guild first and then we can do some shopping. Now, I really hope this is kinda getting off topic. But I really hope y'all can't hear all the wind going on outside. It is such a beautiful day. It is so cold. Like, it's it's like in the 40s, which is how our winters usually are on an average day. And like our room has like no insulation, so like it's very cold in here. But like, it's good for recording. You know, I just, I just whack myself with my own blanket, but I have a blanket. I'm fine. Fighters Guild is locked. Why? Sorry, I just tend to talk about the weather so much. But you know, I find the weather interesting. I know it's usually deemed a boring topic, but I like it. Though I'm also, I don't know how many of you know this, but I'm also a stinky tree hugger. <laughs> I like nature and all of that. I'm basically a wood elf, except my diet is the opposite and I'm probably not a cannibal. Okay, let's turn in this quest. Here's your 184 gold, excellent. Let's take it. Okay, now I'm gonna wait before we get another quest because I wanna go buy some stuff. We are going on a shopping spree today. That definitely seems like sorts type of thing, huh? I guess let's go to like this circle of shops and see what's over there. There is a general store, which I would like to go to because I, I think that's where you buy a cart. I'm pretty sure I saw one. But also I can look around and see where I could sell some of the other stuff maybe. This seems to be a tavern, so is that. This seems to be a weaponsmith. I guess we could go in here and see if they have any dwarven things. He has silver stuff, which is good. <gasps> Elven flail. Oh, but it's still not as good. No, I want a flail. Please, just have a dwarven flail. I don't know if they'll sell dwarven yet, or even if I could just find it, just because I'm so low leveled. 
I may just have to wait. Yeah, I, I don't really think he's gonna have anything for us, sadly. Though the flail is tempting. Buy my crap! No! Alright, let's move on to the next door then. That That's not correct. Oh, these stupid doors! Now, that's an alchemist. I think we've already tried an alchemist. Hmm, I don't know what this is. Guess we'll just go in, check. Oh, hello! Are you okay? Oh, I see, he's reading a book. He's sitting in a very awkward position, like he kind of looks like a crab, but okay. Let's sell some stuff. He what do you buy? I don't know. He buys nothing. Excellent. Okay, well, what do you sell? Books. Oh, I should have figured the sign was books. Ooh, these are expensive books. I bet they're skill books or something. Oh, the Brothers of Darkness, the Dark Brotherhood. But uh, I highly doubt Sork even knows how to read, so <laughs> let's get out of here. He probably does, but I don't know about that. Let's go in the general store. Ah uh, yes, hello creepy-handed man. I believe you're the original creepy-handed man. He will buy this piece of paper. It's worth zero gold. Okay, great. I don't know why I have it then. Yes, a wagon. Okay. How much is the wagon? Are they really that cheap? That's just a small cart though. Can I- can I do stuff with all of this? There's also just plain clothes. Thank you, Daggerfall, for making that terrible sound in my ears. Let's check the other shelves, too. <laughs> What's this one? That's also a small cart. R are they really that cheap? I am in disbelief. Like, he's gonna raise the price on us. Is that a onesie? Amazing. Yeah, it's mostly just a bunch of clothes and whatnot, so maybe we can get both the cart and the horse? Let's see, how much is the horse? Allegedly a thousand. I don't know if it's true. Let's see. Bye. You have bargained me long and hard, Sork the Wanderer. Let us be done. I would normally charge more, but for you, I only ask 1,381 gold. Truly, it is but a pittance. Yeah, sure, we have way more money than that. Hopefully we did that right. Okay. Excellent. Let us leave and try out our horse. <gasps> oh, and our cart? What? Oh, you can travel with your cart. Okay, I assume it's faster just horse. This is so cute! This is amazing! Oh my god. It's all I've ever wanted. Okay. Sorik has a pony. What shall we name it? Ooh, Sparklebutt. His name is Sparklebutt the Pony. Okay, now we should probably go back to the Fighters Guild, get another quest. Because I have still not received a letter. I don't know if there's something else I'm supposed to be doing. Also, I don't remember where the Fighters Guild is. There it is. Not far away at all. Maybe I need to travel somewhere for it to work. Now, I hope there's no, like, bad thing about riding my horse everywhere. I don't feel like there would be. Like, I don't know if I need to replace my horse's horseshoes or something if I ride it too much. I don't know. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm just going to ride it everywhere. All right, let's get another quest. Every once in a while, we get an idiot like this client. <laughs> Some fool left his back door open in a wild animal. Okay, so it's basically the same thing. He seems rather confused as to whether it is a bear or a tiger, but either case, it wanted to eat him. <laughs> Okay, yeah, fine. Great, go over to the Woodsley residence in Longtree Field. I'll give you 12 days to get it, or to kill it and get back to me. I don't remember how much gold he said I was getting for this, but okay. Woodsley residence in Longtree Field. All right. So it looks like we have a little bit of traveling to do, but we have our horse, so it won't be so bad. See, I assume it's in... Tiger Fall, since we have so little time to do it. Ooh, it's all the way over there, though. Okay. Trip call. Okay, travel time, three days. That's not so bad, but that's... That's by ship. Oh, it's actually the same, so we'll take our horse. Oh, and it's actually the same even if we camp out. Okay, well, let's go. Okay, my mercantile skill has improved. All right. Now let's ask where the Woodsley residence is. Ah, he marked it on our map. All right. I love it when they're like that. They're just like, yeah, I'll just mark it. That's much easier. Oh, this place is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. I figured a name like Longtree Field, it would have just been like a couple of farmhouses. But okay, it's up there. Let us get on Sparklebutt. Probably not actually his canon name. We'll, we'll come up with something. Or maybe Sorik would name a horse Sparklebutt. I, I really don't know. But onward we go. Ooh, I should also probably go to a bank so I can put some of my gold up because it does weigh a lot. At least I've spent a good amount of it now. But still, I think I think this is it. Yeah, okay. Just uh hopefully they'll let me in. Let's see. Oh, I actually did get let in. Look at that. 
Oh, well that door's locked. This one's not, however, though they could have put it behind the locked door. I don't know. Let's just look around. I, I definitely hear it. I think it's a tiger again. I feel bad for killing all these tigers. Oh! Oh, I saw a foot! It, wait. Ah, here it is. At least I think that was a foot. Could have been its tail. It just looked like a cat, like, bapping under the door, you know? Okay, it's dead. Simple enough. Let's go back. We probably even have time for one more little quest. Assuming that it's just like a short one in town or basically another wild animal thing. I don't think we have any time to plunder any dungeons. All right. Ah, yes, it is locked. Okay. Guess we'll just wait a couple hours. All right, now we can go in. No great difficulties, I trust. Thought not. Here's your 145 gold. Not bad. Okay. Now I guess let's go ahead and get another one. I have a relatively menial job. A house here in town has been infested by giant rodents. Okay, well, we can do that again. Go there and kill them all and you'll get your pay. I can only give you one day to finish this one. Okay, wait, where was it? Oh god. The Black Wolf. Okay, is that a tavern? I assume that's a tavern. Let's see. The Black Wolf, yes. Okay, just northwest. This guy never seems to like to mark things on my map, so we will ask someone else. There's no reason to talk down to me like that. I can't help you anyway. I was being normal. I'll be blunt with you now. Oh, I can't even change it. Oh, well, you're a jerk. I wasn't talking down to you. Northwest. Okay, on our map now. Good. Uh, okay, it's just right there. Once again, we shall get on our trusty steed. And I think it's this building right here. All right, let's see here. Uh, there are so many people in here. You do know there's an infestation, right? Also, your face is the scariest thing I've ever seen. Okay. Well, uh, maybe it's just in the back room or something? I don't know. Not really hearing anything either. I assume I'm in the right place? I could have walked into the wrong one. I'm not sure. These look like just a bunch of beds, so I doubt in here. Oh, that was the way out. That's not right. Maybe upstairs. Oh, God, right there. Hello. Y'all aren't concerned about this. I'm afraid I'm gonna hit one of them. Okay, well, I guess I'll just wait back here and hope they keep spawning at me. They're just so chill about it. Now, I do know this one takes a little bit, so I'll just wait here in silence and hope they continue to spawn. Oh, I actually just heard another one. Maybe I do need to go upstairs. Maybe they're mostly up there. Where are you? What? Why is there a closet within a closet? This game and its freaking closets. Ooh, I, I heard one. Where are you? Uh... don't quite know what I walked in on there, so I'm just gonna... What was that? I know I hear one! Where are you? Something's making it run all choppy too. Are there just a bunch of rats down there now? Also, this place seems to have no end. Okay, I'm just gonna go back downstairs. I assume they're down there. It's making it run so choppy. You can't handle some rats? Is that too much for you, Daggerfall? Oh, oh, there's one. Oh, there's two. Excellent, okay. Oh god, there's a lot. Okay, they're all coming from here, it looks like. Ah, yes, the main room. Well, I guess I'll just wait for some more. I hear some more, though. Where are they? Have I been through here? Oh. <laughs> looks like there's two exits. I guess I'll just keep wandering around and hope I run into another one. If I can, it's just it's being real choppy. Oh god, there's a lot in here! Hello! Maybe this is all of them. <laughs> I don't know! Come on, there we go. Doesn't look like that was all yet. But it's running a little bit more smoothly, so... I don't hear any, so I assume that's all that's spawned currently? I bet these guys just love all the giant rat corpses around. I'm sure that's appetizing. I know it'll tell me when it's all cleared out. Just nothing seems to want to spawn. Maybe if I go back upstairs, they'll spawn. Oh, it's starting to get choppy again. There might be some rats. Hello. Any rats? Why does it take so long? I wonder if I were to loiter an hour, if more would spawn. I don't really know. I don't even know if they would appreciate it. That that was not the right button. Let's loiter for an hour and see if that works. Not seeing anything. It did tell me when they were all cleared out last time. I don't know why it's not now. Maybe if I go out and go back in. Please? Please just spawn. It's like I'm able to rest in here too, so like... 
There's no rats currently spawned. I wonder if the thing did pop up and I just clicked past it really fast so it didn't actually show itself. I guess we could always go back and check. Why not? Just hopefully that doesn't anger them. Oh, okay. I guess we did do it. Oh, he didn't pay us though. Oh, I don't know if we did that right. Eh. Wasn't there one quest we didn't get paid for? It could have been this one. Maybe this one's just kind of buggy. I don't know. I guess I'll avoid it in the future. But yeah, guys, I do think that's where I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode. I'm still kind of annoyed that we haven't gotten the letter, so I guess all we can really do at this point is just wait until we level again, and then I can do more quests, and just hopefully sometime I'll get the letter. But yeah, don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.